We're back now at uh, 740 with a bit of a mystery. Where is Richard Simmons? The fitness guru hasn't been seen publicly in over two years, and no one, not even his friends, are sure why. The question is, is this his own doing, his own choice, or is he being held against his will, as some reports have suggested? Well, Simmons is now breaking his silence after opening up to us last night in an interview by phone. For 40 years, this is the Richard Simmons the public has grown accustomed to seeing. Do you want to do the twist? Energetic and irresistible. But Richard all but disappeared from the public eye in 2014, and according to a recent New York Daily News article, cut off all contact with his friends. Simmons spoke publicly for the first time in more than two years with us on Sunday by phone. Savannah, it's Richard Simmons. How are you? I'm good, Richard. How are you? I'm feeling good. My health is good. And I'm just sort of enjoying the day. You sound good. It's a sound very few people these days get to hear. In fact, Richard's isolation has been so startling, it has led some of his friends to question if he is being held in his house against his will. What do you make of people being fearful that you're being held up in your own house, that you've become a recluse, that, you know, perhaps people such as your housekeeper are are in control of what you're doing. No one is holding me in my house as a hostage. You know, I do what I want to do as I've always done. So people should sort of just believe what I have to say because like I'm Richard Simmons. I just wanted to ask you point blank about your housekeeper. Is she in any way, is she still employed by you? Is there any issue where you feel she is is controlling you or having any oh, kind of undue no, influence? That's just very silly. Today, Sarah Dallas has been with me for 30 years. It's almost like we're a married couple. But I think your friends or people that have spoken to reporters are saying, but it's not like you to just lose touch completely. I just sort of wanted to be a little bit of a loner for a while. You know, I had hurt my knee, Savannah, mm -hmm. and I had um, some problems with it. And then the other knees started to give me trouble because I've taught like thousands and thousands of classes. Mm. And, you know, right now I just want to sort of, you know, just take care of me. And was this a conscious decision? I just really don't want to do anything. You know, I just don't want to be traveling anymore. It certainly has taken its toll on me. So yeah, it, was, it was not like over a day. It was just over some time. What kinds of things have you been doing? Well, you know, I take walks and I take drives and, you know, I just, you know, go out and get some fresh air and I have a gym upstairs and I've been working out in my gym. And so I've just sort of, you know, enjoyed this time by myself. You wrote in your memoir and have always been very public and very open about going through ups and downs and your own struggles with depression and different things. Survival has always, you know, meant a lot when you're an overweight kid and you're made fun of and you're put down. Some of that stuff never leaves you, Savannah. It yeah. always sort of is like a shadow like Peter Pan. Are you surprised that people have been so worried about you? And for all the people that are worrying about me, I want to tell them that I love them with my whole heart and soul. And that, not to worry, Richard's fine. You haven't seen the last of me. I'll come back, and I'll come back strong. By the way, he said to say hi to all of you guys. Oh, please. He's yeah. a frequent yeah. guest. He used to come almost every year. Yeah. He so says that he just yeah. wants to take time for himself, that he's enjoying being alone. He's enjoying being in his own space. He says he's healthy. He says he's not depressed. Well, he spent so much time working in the out. Yeah, eye. yeah. I know. I think he's just ready understand. to step out. Let's take him at his word. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Hope, hope exactly. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.